Hello friends, in this video we will cover some more data types, Java data types. Now the first one is boolean. Now boolean can hold only two values, either true or false. Both true and false were the keywords in Java. And this is very useful in making decision statements. Okay, like it is uh, very useful in conditions uh, where we uh, require some value true or false means yes or no or zero or one. Okay. Now the other uh, important Java data type is reference. Now, reference data type uh, stores the address of any object. Uh, it is used. Uh, uh, it is used in such a way that if we want to access an object, then we can use objects reference for that okay now the other one is uh, or it can hold null value means nothing uh, means uh, nothing okay now the default values for java data types were uh, like uh, all the arithmetic which we learned in our previous lesson like integer real character and float values uh, all have default value zero uh, uh, means uh, when we create the object uh, and when we create any uh, uh, data type uh, like integer character and we doesn't uh, assign any values to them then it uh, automatically get value zero <coughs> and similarly the reference object get the null value if we doesn't uh, assign any address of any object and uh, similarly in boolean the default value is false Okay, that's all.